Think you're tough. Think you have a brand. Think your name matters. Wrong. Your name doesn't matter, and Twitter is going to prove it. A few months ago, the news that Twitter was abolishing the 140 character limit started making its rounds. And Twitter's confirmed that news now, but things are not going to change in the way that those of us who track such things believed. Instead of expanding the 140 character limit, Twitter is instead changing what counts toward your 140 characters. This is an incredibly insidious move on Twitter's part, and it's smart. And it's not smart enough. With news breaking today that Snapchat is actually used more than Twitter, it's time to take a fresh look at how you manage your social media presence. No, we're not recommending you drop Twitter from your arsenal, nor, frankly, do we believe that Snapchat will remain viable as a business tool for very long. But it's becoming more and more important that you understand what's happening behind the scenes of your social media accounts. Because your name doesn't matter. Those words don't quite mean what they say. Your name doesn't matter, well, of course it does. It matters more and more as you become better known and you cross over the line, for example, where a logo is identifiable as yours. But your name doesn't matter on the internet for anything other than its SEO value and SEO experts have said really for quite a while that optimizing for your own name, well, it's mostly pointless. But Twitter doesn't own your name and their newly announced implementation of an expanded 140 character limit does way more for Twitter than it does for Twitter users. Sure, you'll be able to squeeze more into your tweets, and for folks who've been having trouble with the 140 character thing, not having at names or links count toward it will feel useful. But if Twitter isn't actually expanding the 140, and yet you can get more than 140 characters into tweets, it means that non-visible parts of tweets are coming and they'll be less visible to search engines and in every context other than Twitter showing those characters in their own SEO efforts. In other words, your name doesn't matter anymore, at least not to you. Who actually sees your tweets? Twitter's spin on the death of the 140 character limit pretty much ensures that fewer and fewer people will, thanks very much, unless, well, you know, you can find a way around Twitter's new ownership of your name. Your name doesn't matter. Well, that's nonsense. And, well, we have strategies right here to deal with it. Want to talk? I'm the Answer Guy, and I'll be back.